Hello YouTube, this is Gabe, just making a quick little video. I wanted to show you my little music center that I put together. And here it is. So you've got your turntable on the top here. It's from Music Public Kingdom. It uh, plays 33s and 45s and also has a Bluetooth feature, so that's very nice. Uh, it's got a magnetic cartridge, which you don't really tend to see on these kinds of turntables, so that's very nice built-in speakers, of course, and uh, overall it sounds very good, it's very nice to use. Down below it, we've got the double tape deck from Optimus, the deck on this side is auto-reverse, and right here on the side, hanging off like John McClane on Nakatomi, is the CD player. This is quite obviously an afterthought. I made these little Velcro strips so that I can detach it if I want to and I've got this little cassette adapter thingy for your car right I've got it plugged in here so that if I wanted to I could put it in here and tape my CDs I know it looks silly but it actually works very well and uh, underneath that we've got the cassette storage Let's take a look at those Here are the CDs, uh, there's more in that box right there, and we've got the speakers of course on either side. The speakers I want to talk about for a little moment because I'm very proud of them. I actually made, well I didn't make them but uh, you know what I mean, I'll explain. So I got these a uh, few years back at a flea market for like eight dollars and from what I can tell they used to be part of like a boom box that you could like detach the speakers and space them out because you could see it's got the hooks on the side so I assume that's what that is and I went on Amazon and I bought two of those little uh, 5 volt amplifier boards and I put one of them in here so now it's got a volume knob on the side also acts as the power switch there's the USB plug there and it's got a 3.5 mil plug so anything that has this kind of plug you can use them with and uh, because it runs on USB you can actually power it from this battery pack that I have and it will last hours and hours uh, if not days on a single charge here's the record storage the very ghetto record storage. This is actually an old TV stand. You can see the, the wheels on it. And a crate in an Amazon box. It does a very nice job of holding the records, as trashy as it seems. Uh, it says even more records on there because I've got records, more records, and even more records. So that's why it says that. And uh, that's pretty much it. And uh, now that I've showed it all to you, I'll let you hear some of it. I just got this record today for one dollar. It's a uh, hot butter popcorn. It's a very nice uh, synthesizer type song from the 60s. Um, it's a little bit crackly near the beginning, more crackly than I'd usually like for my record videos that I upload. Usually it's a direct capture from the turntable, but um, today I'm going to go the big guys 45s route and just show it to you like this. Um, by the way, his channel is featured on my channel dashboard, so if you want to go check him out, you can uh, show him some love. And, uh, what on earth? My apologies for that. The cars seem to be having some sort of issue. But um, without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, for your listening pleasure, hot butter popcorn. Thank you.